Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be reviewing the 13th Doctor Tardis with light and sound effects. First, let's look at the box. On the front, we have 13th Doctor Tardis with opening doors, takeoff, and landing light and sound effects. On the top, we have BBC Doctor Who. On the side, we have electronic, the logo, and a bit more of the open window packaging. On the back, we have a picture of the Tardis. We have a synopsis that you can pause the video to read. On the top, we have the Doctor Who logo. And on the side, there is the design of the TARDIS. The top has more of the design of the TARDIS. We have the Doc 2 logo, 13th Doctor TARDIS, and more of the open window packaging. Next up, we of course have the TARDIS itself. Right off the back, you can definitely tell this is the 13th Doctor TARDIS. That is mainly by the colouring. That is sort of a light blue and a bit of green. Um, that's sort of how I can explain it. Um... Not exactly my favourite colour, I always found it looked off in the show. You can also see the portrait open sign there. Sadly, it does not do anything, does not open, there's nothing on the other side. So that's a shame, but it looks, it's good that they got it the right way around. One thing I have noticed is that the framing around the windows is actually white or silver instead of blue. I'm not sure why they did this, because um, the white is only really on the 12th and 11th starters. Um I mean, it's not like it's hard to paint because um, they've moulded it into the, all the B&M sets, the blue, so I'm not sure why they did that. Still, the wood design on it is actually really good. It is, um, there's like been like a dark wash over it, so you can actually see every single detail, which looks great. You can see on that it goes around all onto the sides and onto the top. This is this um, TARDIS has actually been painted, unlike the B&M sets, which are moulded. Um, so it, it's not as see-through, it doesn't look as plasticky, it's mu much more like the original releases, so that's good. On the top of the box, you can see a new lantern. The roof, I'm pretty sure it's the same as the original, um, oh, what was it, the original First Doctor release, and also the original um, Seventh Doctor. So that's a bit of a shame, I feel like they could have done something else, but it works, it works quite well. Taking a look at the back, we have a place for the speaker and a battery compartment. They actually, it's good they're present on this one because it does light up and make sound effects. Um, unlike the um, b &M releases that just have it there for no reason. The doors actually do open, like most other releases. Inside, there is nothing. Okay, well, technically there is not nothing because I put in an image that I printed out just on a um, piece of paper. So, just so it looks like there's something in there. But technically, there's nothing. There was nothing there before, which is sad, because this is actual proper retail release, not just a B&M release. Um, so I'm not sure why I did that. But to close the doors, all you have to do is pull this one in, and there's a little button on the bottom to close that one. Since this TARDIS does have sound effects, there you go. That is the same sound as the 11th and 10th Doctor um, Tardises, and also 12th. Um, so that's a bit of a shame that they didn't make a new one, but it works, it works fine. Um, the lantern actually pulsates, pulsates blue after you've um, put it down, and when you pick it up... It makes that sound effect, so I think just does go on for a little too long, and then the light just pulsates after that. I don't have the 13th Doctor, so it look, does look quite good next to 8th Doctor and 7th Doctor, um, because it is very close to their TARDIS, except from a few differences. But it also looks great next to a reconnaissance Dalek. That is my only other um, Season 11 slash Season 12 um, character. For comparisons, here is the 13th Doctor Tardis, next to 11th Doctor Tardis, 10th Doctor Tardis, 5th, 4th, 4th, and 3rd. And they all fit very well together and look great. Anyway guys, thank you for watching. 
This isn't the greatest idea ever, but if you want to do a custom for um, 1st or 7th or 8th or anything like that, you can. Um, also, if you like the 13th Doctor, you can get this. So anyway, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.